Welcome back to our channel where we share updates and untold stories about Catherine, Princess of Wales, and her royal family. Today we bring you some news. Catherine and William have reportedly ousted Camilla over Harry, marking a smart move for the new monarchy. According to an insider source, Princess Catherine and Prince William's bold maneuver against Queen Camilla regarding Harry's matter is a notable act of defiance and strategic planning. Princess Catherine, the Duchess of Cambridge, has boldly relieved Queen Camilla of her regal duties. This difficult conflict involving Prince Harry and Meghan Markle allegedly instigates this covert action, plunging the British monarchy into chaos and scrutiny. The changing dynamics of power expose an unexpected rift between Catherine and Camilla, threatening the delicate balance within the House of Windsor. This event has astonished both royal analysts and the general public, signaling a significant shift of power. An intimate source suggests that Princess Catherine is reinstating her royal duties, purportedly in full support of Prince William's ambitious agenda for the monarchy. This concept has created much turmoil at Buckingham Palace, notably impacting Queen Camilla, a contentious figure within the royal hierarchy. King Charles's final decision about Camilla's role in the monarchy has left her astonished and enraged. Reports indicate that King Charles's medical evaluations and the concluding negotiations at Buckingham Palace over Queen Camilla's future role have identified Princess Catherine as the preeminent royal figure. This development has stunned Queen Camilla and surprised Prince Harry, who has been closely monitoring the changing dynamics within the royal family. The genesis of the dispute is rooted in the ongoing saga of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, which has significantly contributed to the tensions within the royal family. Prince Harry's decision to abdicate his position as a senior royal and move to California with Meghan Markle was a pivotal moment indicating a significant transformation in the monarchy's dynamics. The couple's January 2020 announcement to abdicate their senior royal titles was unusual, eliciting varied responses from the public and the media. Since then, Prince Harry has been the focal point of several controversies, often arising from his harsh criticisms of the royal family. A notable incident occurred in March 2021, when Harry and Meghan participated in a noteworthy conversation with opera Winfrey. During this interaction, they leveled serious charges, including accusations of racial prejudice within the royal family and suggestions of disregarding Meghan's mental health issues. The public saw these disclosures as a direct challenge to the monarchy exacerbating their already vulnerable status and revealing private familial issues to public examination. The issue intensified with the publication of Harry's book, Spare, in early 2023. The book included a comprehensive examination of his personal life and his tumultuous relationship with his brother, Prince William, and other relatives. The detailed revelations of his personal experiences as well as the internal discord within the royal family, heightened public interest and media attention. The book faced criticism for disclosing personal issues and confidential information about the royal family's private life, intensifying Harry's estrangement from his cousins. Since assuming his new position as a commentator and vocal critic of the monarchy, Prince Harry has faced several challenges. His participation in films and television programs, public appearances and media statements has often centered on criticizing the establishment to which he once belonged. This swift shift from prince to vocal critic has elicited feelings of betrayal among many individuals, especially those who previously regarded him as a loyal member of the royal family. The extensive media coverage of his personal matters and disputes has heightened friction within the royal family and had considerable consequences for the monarchy overall. Princess Catherine's intentional silence amidst this tumultuous period has been notable. In response to the escalating issue involving Meghan Markle, this stands in stark contrast to her husband's increased participation in the situation. 
Catherine, known for her steadfast politeness, has navigated the turmoil with a cool manner that reflects her deep dedication to her role within the royal family. Despite facing considerable public attention, she has mostly refrained from commenting on the scandals involving Prince Harry, opting instead to concentrate on her charitable endeavors and obligations as a member of the royal family. Catherine's approach closely adheres to the current royal policy of refraining from engagement and avoiding entanglement in public family conflicts. She carefully constructs her public statements and appearances to highlight her status as a prospective queen and committed spouse. Instead of confronting the particulars of the royal conflict, one could interpret her reluctance to openly express her opinions as a subtle form of dissent or an implied rejection of the current tensions. Catherine's comportment and statements are calculated and formal, demonstrating her commitment to her royal duties. Unlike many who have adopted a more confrontational stance, her unwavering dedication distinguishes her from the chaos produced by Prince Harry's choices, displaying a unique set of objectives and principles. Queen Camilla's intricate ties have been a subject of discussion. Members of the royal circle have long been aware of the complex relationship that Queen Camilla has with Prince Harry and Princess Catherine. Camilla, the Queen Consort of the United Kingdom has a prominent role within the royal circle, leading to public and media scrutiny of her interactions with other royal members. Despite their common royal lineage, Camilla has a cordial relationship with both Prince Harry and Catherine, albeit their relationships are complex. The contentious relationship between Camilla and Prince Harry is particularly noteworthy, especially given Harry's candid critique of the royal family and its internal dynamics. Harry perceives Camilla as a constant outsider, an intruder who played a role in the disintegration of his parents' marriage. This perspective has fostered ongoing friction between them, and an intrinsic coldness and subtle but palpable animosity have always marked Camilla's encounters with Harry. Despite her efforts to mend relations, despite Camilla's attempts to cultivate a relationship with Catherine, their connection has seen sporadic upheaval. Both women have experienced considerable stress from public perception and the monarchy, resulting in visible signs of strain. Throughout the years, Camilla has mostly shown her support for Catherine, Nevertheless, this encouragement has sometimes been imbued with a feeling of competition. Recent rumors indicate that Camilla may display rudeness or hostility towards Catherine, especially considering Catherine's rising status within the royal circle. Princess Catherine is becoming more prominent. Despite these challenges, Princess Catherine's influence within the monarchy persists. Princess Anne, noted for her steadfast dedication to royal duties, has reportedly expressed her support for Catherine in this undertaking. We believe Anne's endorsement is a significant recommendation because of her renowned position within the royal circle, as well as her reputation for thoroughness and devotion among her colleagues. The Queen anticipates that Princess Anne will mentor Catherine, equipping her for the heightened responsibilities associated with her enhanced rank. Princess Catherine's elevated status reflects her personal qualities and functions as a deliberate tactic to ensure the monarchy's stability and longevity. Her poised demeanor and dedication to her duties have favorably influenced public image, reinforcing her position as a distinguished member of the royal family. This tendency has received approval from royal aficionados who see Catherine's increased responsibilities as a positive progression towards a modern and relevant monarchy. The public's reaction to these events has been diverse, with several people expressing their endorsement of Princess Catherine and Prince William's behavior. Social media platforms are now engaging in discourse over the power dynamics inside the royal circle, with hashtags such as hash Team Kate and hash Monarchy Restructure gaining traction. Advocates of Catherine and William see their endeavors as a crucial strategy to enhance the monarchy and address persistent challenges within the royal family. Royal experts have offered their insights on the implications of this power change historian and royal critic doctor. 
Anna Whitelock believes that Catherine's growing prominence is a strategic endeavor to preserve the monarchy's relevance in the 21st century. Princess Catherine has the qualities necessary for a modern monarchy, dedication, accessibility, and a deep sense of duty, Whitelock said. Her expanded responsibilities indicate the royal family's efforts to adapt to changing conditions. In contrast, several experts have expressed concerns over the potential consequences of Queen Camilla's reduced authority. Royal biographer Penny Juner stated Queen Camilla has substantially aided King Charles and fostered stability within the royal family. Her reduced influence may lead to increased conflict and uncertainty, particularly regarding ongoing issues with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Queen Camilla's discontent and eroding authority have reportedly led to anger and annoyance. Palace insiders have said that Camilla has participated in several bitter disagreements with King Charles about his decision to elevate Princess Catherine's status. The conflicts have led to a significant reduction in Camilla's influence within the royal circle, prompting apprehensions over her potential role as queen consort. Camilla's discontent with the changes inside the royal circle is not unprecedented. She has previously expressed her feelings about perceived unfair treatment and a lack of recognition for her contributions to the monarchy. Recent occurrences have exacerbated this position, significantly damaging her ties with other royal family members. Princess Anne's support for Catherine has been significant. Princess Anne has purportedly shown her support for Princess Catherine, who is recognized for her pragmatic disposition and dedication to royal duties. Anne's backing is viewed as a crucial asset. We expect Anne to play a vital role in educating Catherine, as per the Queen's instructions, to prepare her for the increased responsibilities linked to her elevated status. Princess Anne's support for Catherine not only highlights Catherine's abilities, but also serves as a strategic measure to ensure the monarchy's continuity. Anne's skills and insight will be crucial for Catherine as she assumes her new role and responsibilities. We expect that the collaboration between Anne and Catherine will elevate the royal family's public perception and reaffirm their commitment to duty and service. The media has swiftly exploited the escalating friction within the royal family, with headlines ranging from sensational to analytical. Prominent publications have shown a tendency to exaggerate the narrative using dramatic headlines such as Royal Rift, Camilla and Catherine's Cold War and family rivalry, Camilla vs. Catherine, as prominent front-page features. These news pieces often emphasize the interpersonal conflict between the two royal figures and the potential impact on the monarchy, feeding public interest in the evolving dynamics. In conclusion, the internal dynamics of the British monarchy remain intricate and tumultuous. The shifting power dynamics involving Princess Catherine, Queen Camilla, and Prince Harry unveil the intricate and evolving nature of royal relations. As Princess Catherine enhances her position and influence, we anticipate further developments and transformations within the royal family. What are your thoughts on these recent developments? We welcome your opinions in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights into royal news and stories.